we're talking shorts and how to wear them when you're over 40. For such a small piece of clothing, shorts seem to stir up a lot of emotions for women. I recently did a blog post where I was wearing two different pairs of shorts. One had a 5 inch inseam and the other a 9 inch inseam. And the comments are what got me thinking about doing this video. My name is Tanya Stevens. I'm the face behind 50 is not old and I want to welcome you to my channel. My mission is to help women feel better about themselves and I use fashion and beauty as my tools. My goal is to have you remember that age is just an attitude and you should keep yours young. So be sure to follow my channel and click the little red bell so that you never miss a post. To begin with, I don't believe that age determines what length of shorts you should wear. We are all different. We all have different likes and different comfort levels. So we should all be kind to each other and not make judgment about someone else's appearance based on our own comfort levels. Ask yourself. First thing I want to do is ask, myself, ask yourself, do the shorts fit well? Are they appropriate length for the venue or the event or occasion? In other words, if I'm going to the lake, a three inch pair of distressed denim shorts could be fine. But if I was going to a fancier event, then I might want to wear a different fabric or possibly even a different length. Otherwise, it really doesn't matter how old you are or even what your legs look like. I have leopard printed legs, you know what I'm talking about, those spots from my not so smart years of tanning without sunscreen. Now they're not particularly attractive, but I still wear shorts. And I can promise you this, no one pays as much attention to you or your supposedly imperfections as you do. Yes, I'm still sometimes self-conscious, but I'm putting my photos on the internet for anyone to look at and judge me. And I know that can be scary. So I try to remind myself, even when those thoughts pop up in my head and people are looking at me, that the overall concept they're looking at is not my spotted legs. They're looking at the outfit or the styles. With all that said, if you're not comfortable wearing shorts, then do what makes you feel good. Don't wear shorts just because everyone else is. But if you live in a hot climate where you're burning up, then don't let other people's opinions trump your comfort level. Especially, you don't even know them. So now that we've talked about if you should wear shorts or can wear shorts, let's talk about the length of the shorts and how to know what you should wear. Once again, age should not determine the length of the shorts you wear. Some people may look better in a two inch or a three inch inseam, while others prefer something closer to the knees. Some like a fuller leg, and some feel more confident with a leg that is a tighter fitting. So do, as I said, what makes you feel better. But before we determine what is a short short or a long short, let's determine what is a medium length short. So medium length shorts are universally the most flattering and most women can wear them. And to determine what a mid length, mid length is for yourself, put your hands down to your side and notice where the tip of your longest finger hits. That's basically where the mid length level is. So most people have a range and not an exact measurement for the shorts. For me, I like to wear shorts in all length and it all depends upon where I'm going, but my range that I generally stay within is a four to a seven inch. And that happens to be hit right in my mid length range, which is five inch. I consider short shorts to be anything up to four inches. My mid range lengths, I consider to between five and nine inch and everything over that is a Bermuda or a Capri length. As a rule, Petite ladies tend to look better in shorter shorts. When you show more skin, it gives the illusion of longer legs. And if you're tall, then you can probably pull off a Bermuda short 
which might look frumpy on someone else. No matter if you're tall, petite, or plus, I think that it looks best if your shorts follow the line of your legs. You don't want them to be too tight or too wide. If they're too tight, then they make you uncomfortable and they're probably also too tight maybe in the crotch or the rear area, and that's not a good look. But if they're too wide, they can make you look frumpy and they can make your legs look scrawny. So keep them in proportion to your legs. My biggest encouragement for you is to realize that our legs are the same legs we've had since we were in our 20s. And they have lots more miles on them. And they're probably not near as toned. And they have spots and cellulite and scars and lots of veins. Just remember when you look at your legs that those veins are supplying your body with what it needs. Show your legs proudly. So, with all that said, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And if you found it helpful, please share it so other women can find it just like you. And I always appreciate a thumbs up to keep those algorithm gods happy and comments are off, off, also welcomed. I will link to any of the outfits that I've shown you below. You may have to click the see more or the little arrow that, uh, just click on that and it will pop up a whole new section. <sighs> Have a great day.